interview her a week ago. <laughs> I am here with Rachel Platten. How are you? Hi, honey. Great. Uh, Musicians on Call. This is such a great organization. And I, you've been involved for a really long time. Talk about that. Since um, for the past 12 years, I've been working with them and volunteering in the city. When I first moved to New York, I couldn't figure out how to make this career happen. And what I thought of was, well, if I can give, then I won't be so focused on what I don't have. You know, I'll be focused on the power that I do have and the love that I can spread. Do you have any good stories of, of going to hospitals or any anyone that stands out? There are so many incredible ones. I have like a funny one and a sad one. I have um, one of the funny ones was an older woman kind of just started screaming halfway through the song oh. and was like really upset. And I was like, I don't think I healed her. What song was it? I, it was like an original that okay. I was trying out. <laughs> did you end up, did it make, is it making it on the album? <laughs> I was like, I think that's a sign. I never played oh it again. <laughs> um, congratulations, Fight Song reached 100 million views on YouTube. I know, I'm shocked. What? talked about how this is a song you wrote at one of the darkest periods of your life. How, how crazy is this for you? It is the most amazing thing. I was going through a really hard time and I had to make a decision, do I keep going? Do I keep trying to make this career happen? I was playing house concerts to like 20 people and that song was a declaration that I wasn't going to give up on myself. And the fact that it has made my dreams come true is, is so incredible. It's amazing. And I love that you were on stage with Taylor Swift recently. How was that whole experience? Amazing. It was incredible. She's just as wonderful and lovely as she seems and she's really genuine and giving and she's given me great advice too over the past couple months. Are you a part of the squad and what was the best <laughs> advice she gave you? Um, you know, she told me, I think I was on a bill once with people that I was like, oh my gosh, they can sing so much better than me, they're so much better and she was like, it's really not about that, it's about being authentic and being genuine and it's about the songs and sharing what you have. And that helped a lot. It helped me remind, you know, kind of remember what I do, which is I hope I just want to spread love with the music. And your album Wildfire is going to be out very soon. We're yes. excited. Um, I want to know, okay, one of the titles, because you've been tweeting the titles, you've had fans oh, tweet yes, it. Oh, that's right, yeah. What is Astronauts about? Um, it's a really sweet song. It's about a couple that can escape the world, and if the whole world went away, they'd be okay. And it's kind of like... I don't know, it's a non-judgment, you know, like people might tell you that you're in the wrong relationship, but it really just matters how you two feel. I love that. And what are you most proud of with this album? Oh, I don't know. I think, you know, I've been working for three and a half years on it, and I'm just proud that all of the lyrics really feel authentic and honest, and they're my story. Awesome. Well, congratulations. Have fun tonight. It's so good to see you again. Thank you so much, honey. Bye.